manganese zinc low flow batteries or something like that magnesium zinc uh, manganese dioxide flow batteries zinc dioxide project pointed out sum it up for you cut it cut a lot of this up for you these systems have to be able to flow at under reasonable pressures but also have a weak yield stress so that the active manganese oxide well, particles probably don't back here you're missing a few parts that make it up system but... isn't being used as well as not separate into a battery oily clear fluid phase and a dense paste of carbon particles and manganese oxide all of which sounds a bit tricky to me so you see why so i would do that to a mason robot about words that sound the same but testing to see if they could find an optimal combination of all the elements in the mix not just from a physical mechanical and operational performance point of view but also carefully considering the economic viability of the system Careful calculating what's known as the levelized battery. cost of storage or lcos versus other so storage sure, technologies yeah. using what the researchers refer to as techno economic analysis based on previously published industry data 